We'll be right back oh. with a smitten Jennifer Beals after these Obsessed messages with Billy. local state. He loves him. I cannot tell you how I just know every bit of that routine. Start to finish. This Love morning, it. Billy was rocking out of his dressing room. Personal hero here with me, Jennifer Beals in Flashdance, the scene that, and movie that introduced her to the world and became a, you became a pop culture phenomenon. And you introduced leggings to the world. There you and go. now we have jeggings. So really, without the leggings, Thank we you. wouldn't have the jeggings. You have done so you, much. I don't know what jeggings are. You know what, They're Billy, these. stand up. <laughs> No, they're what girls wear. <laughs> she calls because mine are my jeans are a little, are a little tight. tight. But it's what girls wear. They're like leggings that look like jeans. They're jeggings. They're jeggings. And you started it all off. No, and I did that. You can't blame shirt. me for that jegging. was all you, yeah, Jennifer. It's all your fault. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, anyway, Jennifer now starring in Chicago Code on last night. New show that Fox is getting rave reviews for. And let's talk about that. People Magazine, four out of four stars. No, oh, that was exciting. Show is hot. Why is it hot? <laughs> Besides you, you're very Did you hot. share just break? I, I'm having trouble sitting in my chair for some reason. I don't know. And you're very charming, so it's incredibly distracting. Oh, hey. wow. Um, no, it is. going on. Should I step out? <laughs> you know what? Yes. <laughs> Why is the show so hot? Well, gosh, I, I guess people like it. I don't know. Well, I mean, it's a terrific show. You've got action. You've got politics. You've got, you know, a female superintendent Boss. of police and you know, it's good stuff. Tell me the relationship between you and, and the male lead. He's, he's a brooding, tough, you know, street cred kind of guy. Is I like that, you. Does this, a little bit like me, yeah. does, does this develop into something? As this is it's developing clearly, into something? Clearly, clearly. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, they were partners on the street. When, before she became superintendent, they were partners and they rode in the car and solved all kinds of crimes together. And, and he is sort of more of a cowboy and she has a sense of the bigger picture and how to fight corruption. She's sexy. I mean, you could dress you up in the uniform, but you still You're look kind. sexy. You're a kind Are we going to see any sexy stuff on this show? God, wouldn't that be nice? Yeah. I mean, can That'd you write something. in? Yes. Um, yeah. You know, it's subtle, but it's there. I do my best to play the sexuality, even though it's not something that I can play very readily because, you know, frankly, as a woman in power, if you're playing your sexuality too often, you uh, run the risk of losing your credibility and, and appearing as, as weak. So it's a funny um, balance that she has to walk. That's great. Yeah. Hey, um, do you miss being a lesbian on television? The <laughs> The L word. The L you word. Know what? My, my, um, my husband misses me being a lesbian. Yeah? Did he yeah. like to slow it down? Or? No, no, no. I just think, you know, I, once I stopped doing the L word and I got on a set with all men, it was like, you know, getting into a candy store. It was very exciting. I just was spending time smelling men. I missed, had missed the smell. Though I loved being, <laughs> um, I loved working with women and it was a real, actually it was a real um, honor to work with that many women because it's a you smart show it's a smart show but you also process things differently and it became very clear how women process things differently we like to talk about things we talk things through and in that process you not only learn about the other person what their opinion is but you start to learn about how you feel about something and it's a it's a really it was a really great set how many uh how many years have you been married gosh uh 12. okay what do you expect how would the perfect valentine's day how would it go down would your husband initiate something spectacular? Is it subtle? Does he wear the sweatshirt off the shoulder and come get you? <laughs> or maybe he dresses like Spike from Buffy the Vampire Slayer. That's who you like. Spike? I don't know. What can I say? Is it and a getaway? I, is it a, is it a is rotating it waterbed? No, is it, uh... I, I, I think it's a family thing. Like, it's a more kind of... It's not, you know, Kids so sexualized. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Chicago Code was on last Good. night. Check it out on Hulu or something. Track it down online if you missed the first episode. It's Monday nights at 9 on Fox. Lots more live coming your way. We're cooking with Biggest Loser trainer Bob Harper. It's all in just two and a half minutes. So listen, I was a fighter pilot <laughs> in the first Gulf War. Uh, and I had several bombing missions.